Okay, so our project is an automatic, automatic rock band player on an FPGA. Uh, we take in the NTSC signal from an Xbox, decode it on here, and out, uh, we look at certain grids of pixels for our detection. You can see these white boxes on the screen. Each one represents a 3x3 three three grid of pixels where we check for a specific color threshold, and if all nine pixels are above the threshold, we register that a note is hit, stored into a buffer to be uh, played by the instrument later. We give the data to our instruments via a wireless link. We have a wireless transmitter from the FPGA that goes to the three different instruments. Each have a wireless receiver that's on a custom PCB board hooked up to six optocouplers that are wired in parallel with the various instruments so that the uh, functionality of the instrument is unchanged. All the buttons still work even while our system is running and the instruments will be, will be just as functional as they were from the beginning if you take the system out. So all the instruments still work, can be used by a human player. For the vocals, we have two vertical strips of detection, one to the left of that center line there and one to the right. The one on the left is checking the position of the arrow, which is our current output pitch, and the one on the right is checking the position of the incoming pitch. We use feedback to tell whether to move up or down in pitch and by how much. And then we generate that tone on the FPGA using direct digital synthesis output through the speakers to the microphone and all the instruments with their interface with the actual Xbox is the traditional interface be it wired or wireless we didn't uh, do anything with Microsoft's proprietary interface